Betelgeuse, located in the constellation Orion, is like the rock star of stars. It's one of the most recognizable and beloved celestial beings in the sky. Its vibrant red hue and prominent position have made it a favorite among both stargazers and astronomers. But what truly sets Betelgeuse apart is its mysterious behavior that keeps scientists on their toes. Betelgeuse's pulsation is like a cosmic dance routine. It expands and contracts, causing its brightness to fluctuate, making it one of the most dynamic stars in the night sky. This behavior has led many to believe that Betelgeuse is on the brink of a supernova explosion. However, could it be that this pulsation is actually a testament to the star's resilience? Welcome to Astro World, where stargazing stories are told. Let's start with what makes Betelgeuse so intriguing, its enigmatic behavior. This red giant star has been pulsating, expanding, and contracting in size over time, capturing the attention of astronomers worldwide. One of the reasons Betelgeuse's pulsation raises eyebrows is its seemingly never-ending nature. The star has been pulsating for at least two centuries, showing no signs of slowing down. This longevity challenges the notion that it's on the verge of a catastrophic explosion. Perhaps, Betelgeuse has found its cosmic rhythm, constantly defying expectations. Stars like Betelgeuse are known for their pulsations, but what makes Betelgeuse stand out is its size. It's a red supergiant, around 15 to 20 times more massive than our sun. Imagine a stellar heavyweight, ready to unleash its stellar fireworks at any moment. Betelgeuse's pulsations, although not as grand as those of the famous Mira, are still quite remarkable. But here's the cosmic conundrum. Does Betelgeuse's pulsation indicate a countdown to its inevitable supernova explosion, or is it simply a part of its stellar identity? Scientists have been pondering this question, and the answers are as mysterious as the star itself. Betelgeuse continues to keep us guessing with its never-ending pulsation. Some astronomers believe that this pulsation is a natural part of Betelgeuse's life cycle, a result of its internal dynamics and the interplay of its stellar layers. It's like the star's way of stretching its cosmic muscles and flexing its stellar prowess. On the other hand, there are those who wonder if this pulsation is a sign of an impending supernova. They theorize that as Betelgeuse pulsates, it's gradually building up to a critical point where its core will collapse, triggering a cataclysmic explosion that will reverberate across the cosmos. The truth is, we still have much to learn about Betelgeuse's pulsation and its connection to its ultimate fate. Scientists are tirelessly studying this celestial performer, gathering data, and developing models to unravel the cosmic secrets hidden within Betelgeuse's mesmerizing pulsation. Betelgeuse, known for its variable nature, experiences fluctuations in brightness, like a celestial light show. But the great dimming took things to a whole new level. Within a matter of months, Betelgeuse's brilliance faded by a staggering 60%, leaving us bewildered and searching for answers. As astronomers set out to unravel this cosmic puzzle, they discovered a remarkable culprit, a cloud. Stars like Betelgeuse are not just celestial fireballs, they're also cosmic artists, constantly painting the sky with their stellar winds, expelling gas and dust into space. And in this case, a massive clump of gas, as large as the star itself, obscured its light. While the great dimming was ultimately attributed to this cosmic cloud, Betelgeuse had more surprises in store for us. Just as we thought we had unraveled the mystery, the star rebounded, returning to its former glory and shining brighter than ever before. It was as if Betelgeuse wanted to keep us on our cosmic toes, reminding us that the universe is full of surprises. Now, the question remains, what caused this sudden brightening? Astronomers have their theories. Some suggest that the same dust cloud that caused the dimming might now be reflecting the star's light toward us, creating the illusion of a dazzling resurgence. But the truth is, we are still unraveling the secrets of Betelgeuse's great dimming. It's like a cosmic whodunit, with astronomers donning their metaphorical detective hats, searching for clues in the vast reaches of space. Each piece of the puzzle brings us closer to understanding the enigmatic behavior of this celestial superstar. One crucial factor in a star's potential to explode is its fuel supply, 
and when it comes to Betelgeuse, the fiery giant in the constellation Orion, it hasn't exhausted its hydrogen reserves just yet. This fact plays a significant role in understanding the star's future and its likelihood of undergoing a cataclysmic supernova event. Like a cosmic furnace, stars derive their energy from nuclear fusion, the process of converting lighter elements into heavier ones. In the case of Betelgeuse, hydrogen serves as its primary fuel source, undergoing fusion to form helium. This fusion reaction releases an incredible amount of energy, which is what makes stars shine so brilliantly in the night sky. But here's the fascinating part, Betelgeuse is a red supergiant, a massive star nearing the end of its life cycle. While it has already burned through a significant portion of its hydrogen, astronomers speculate that there could still be plenty left in its stellar tank. If this is true, it could keep the star in a delicate balance between stability and the potential for an explosive finale. To understand this delicate dance, we need to delve into the internal dynamics of Betelgeuse. As hydrogen is consumed in the star's core, it produces an immense amount of energy, counteracting the force of gravity trying to collapse the star and on itself. This balance between energy release and gravitational collapse keeps the star stable, preventing it from undergoing a supernova. However, as the hydrogen fuel depletes, Betelgeuse will face a critical juncture. The star's core will start to contract under its own gravity, and the pressure and temperature will rise to a point where helium fusion becomes possible. This transition marks a significant shift in the star's evolution, as it begins to burn helium and fuse it into heavier elements like carbon and oxygen. But the real question remains, when will Betelgeuse reach this tipping point and potentially go supernova? Scientists have been working tirelessly to predict the star's fate, running complex computer models to simulate its evolution. The results have yielded estimates ranging from a few thousand years to as far as 1.5 million years into the future. In other words, while Betelgeuse's hydrogen reserves have not been fully depleted, it still has a significant amount of stellar life left. So, while we may anticipate its ultimate explosion, it's a cosmic event that is unlikely to occur within our lifetimes or even within the span of many generations. Betelgeuse, with an estimated age of at least 8 million years, is considered a mature star. However, this age doesn't necessarily imply imminent doom. In fact, many stars far older than Betelgeuse have continued to shine brightly without succumbing to supernova explosions. Age might just be a number when it comes to this cosmic superstar. Betelgeuse serves as a captivating celestial spectacle, reminding us of the vastness and complexity of the universe. As we continue to study and understand the intricate workings of these stellar giants, Betelgeuse stands as a testament to the ongoing exploration of the cosmos and the mysteries that await us in the depths of space. That's it for today's video. What are your thoughts? Let us know what you think in the comments below. And hey, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Your support helps us reach more people with our content. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more updates.